it was a uh, kind of mid-level insomnia. I had a little trouble going to sleep, uh, waking up too early, and not really getting deep or a restful sleep. It's not the pillow. Uh, it's, it wasn't the bed. Uh, I'm not really sure what was causing it. Uh, I guess a couple of years ago I had a bout with insomnia. Insomnia is a huge problem. Sleep disorders uh, affect so many people in the United States. It's thought that up to half the people actually have some problem with sleep uh, each week. We're using a new approach. Uh, there's been many, many different things used for insomnia in the past, but this one is, is using a technology that's a form of biofeedback or brain feedback, if you will. The brain uh, uh, can get imbalanced. That uh, occurs when there are responses to, to traumas, such as the fight or flight, the sympathetic or parasympathetic responses. That helps you survive, get through that. But if those, those responses get stuck, that imbalance can lead to many kinds of symptoms, uh, one of which can be problems with insomnia and sleep. This new approach actually uh, evaluates the brain energy. It measures it very precisely, looking for imbalances in what should be a fairly balanced energetic pattern. And then this technology uh, actually uses a, a form of feedback and assign a musical note to it, a tone, so that the, the person that is undergoing brainwave optimization is actually hearing a series of notes or tones in their ear. That allows the brain, in essence, to look at itself in the mirror, kind of see what would be a more optimal balance or more optimal energetic pattern and without doing anything, just really sitting and listening to that feedback, the brain begins to balance itself. With that kind of balance, uh, the goal is, and what we're studying in this project, is to see whether that can eliminate the symptoms, in this case, uh, insomnia. But uh, it was after the second session where I got a better night's sleep and I noticed at work that it was a uh, as if the day was just floating along. Yeah. Uh, I was working so much more efficiently. And uh, in a lot of subtle ways, I didn't know that there was so much room for improvement in uh, the way that I operated. We've identified and enrolled 20 subjects uh, for this project. Uh, Ten of them randomly got assigned to the group who, who would receive brainwave optimization first, right to start with, while the other ten uh, continued their usual care. We made many kinds of measurements before they st we started and then after that, that first wave of, of uh, uh, brainwave optimization, and we'll be analyzing that. Insomnia is the first thing that we're working on, but we have plans to, to apply the same technology to many other conditions, such as migraine, traumatic brain injury and post-traumatic stress disorder, uh, even hypertension, high blood pressure, uh, where there appear to be imbalances in the brain that, that seem to be driving some of these symptoms and disorders. And, uh, it was at a good time, it really was, to, uh, to discover this study. I didn't know what to expect, but uh, it, it's been a, a big difference, sleeping much better.